one way did dumb woman how I ya no more day at two morning, and ya said, Debia, ya ma woman capre, and a damano. Software engineer and a Juma so a nipper papa, a rafa reader, Nana F. Wabajay, cerebral palsy, a Jenny B. A one or so, Nancy Wamana and Yakuin, see, dear so beckon in him a wabra boom, or dear Futu Ama Bain say, Ninia no more sebi or modi dem no more moon sem in ya won, at the same or the two jawa bra, charismatic and evangelistic ministry, Womdu Mujum Media, what to then say ability project a bar, or more pa hun to ma. I'm happy about this, 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 this village thing. Yeah, it's very, very important and commendable. I hope you'll be able to raise the funds because for, for, for my peers, Papa Ghana does not want to be associated with, with disability issues. And I hope that will change. I'm thinking from a peer because I have tried to raise funds for things with disability. And I've been told that, that oh, our brand doesn't want to be associated with disability. And that is very sad and very, but very helpful because it doesn't discriminate. It Dina say, and I was swap for our share a money memma and quadana face so as it's in a mu bambo on munyan for Cynthia Mamley Morrison Eddie to just say, Yen Yanu must say you made it them no, and Momu shed the moon soon and Momon Tena, name Mumyanko Pando Machadi our day at two Momono, or Munsha no Momon and Neddy. Now, what shall one so say? What in a one day a better ability project no a chick of him say, or more a baby. Marina says something that raising money for physically challenged is a big hustle. You go and you speak your mind and it's like you hear from us and you don't hear. But I believe in my heart that with this one, we will hear. My education this morning is that even though you are in a wheelchair, even though you are deaf and dumb, even though you, can, you, are, even, you are not in a wheelchair and you are rolling on the floor, let's take our children to school. Let's educate those children. They will come and take care of us. I'm looking at what this village, what I was sitting there, I'm like, so is this village going to be there perpetually? I'm looking for a village where we put adult disabled people, but we have children who would come and take care of the village because we are going to raise doctors and lawyers and pastors and presidents from that village. This is not going to be a poor village. It's going to be a village where the disabled is going to raise up the mighty who will take up this nation.